Hey, this is Steve Greenstein from Jim's Harley Davidson here in St. Pete. And today we're going to talk about helmets. And this one's a little small for me, so that's one thing we can talk about. This is Connie Mundo, my motor clothes manager and helmet expert. And she's going to tell you how helmets are made today. This one here happens to be one of the best. This is the carbon Kevlar uh, style, but let's start at the beginning. There's three different styles of helmet. There's the, bad, the good, the better, and the best. The good is made out of a thermoplastic material. It's actually injection um, into the, the helmet. And so it's, it's a lot thinner of a core on the outside, but the inside then they'll have to do a, a thicker EPS lining to give you more protection. That's your good helmet. It's got the detachable neck piece and everything like that that, you know, when it's cooler, you can wear it and then you can zip it off when you have the warmer days. Going from good to better is the fiberglass helmet. The fiberglass helmet, you've got layers of fiberglass and resin that go on top of each other. So it gives you a little bit stronger of a helmet core on the outside, but um, it's still not the best. Your best goes into your carbon Kevlar. And then the carbon Kevlar, what they use is layers of carbon and layers of lots of, of resin. And so it's a little bit lighter because as you go from the thermoplastic, because you've got a heavier inside, to the, your fiberglass to this, this is your lightest helmet. This only weighs one pound, uh, 12 ounces. So it's real light. You've got the breathing mechanisms through it. It vents through the front to the back. And this seems to be the choice of the riders today because it's not so hot and heavy. Thank you, Steve. And thank you so much. So here we go. These are how helmets are made. Again, this is Steve Greenstein, Jim's Harley-Davidson, St. Pete. Be safe.